Hello guys, nagtataka ba kayo bakit ang, ang Facebook page nyo is not a reco- unrecommendable? So, ito yung baseline standard ng Facebook pa para ma-maintain yung Facebook nyo na recommended, recommendable. So, ito yung limang categories na ititiscuss natin baka isa sa mga categories, mga rules niya ay nag break kayo or may violation ng mga rules or feed you news kaya kaya yung reason bakit unrecommendable ang Facebook nyo naging box na kayo inalisin yung mga videos pero ganun pa rin so maaaring may mga violations kayo sa community standards ng Facebook ito yung limang categories na discuss natin isa-isa para ma-check nyo ma-delete nyo yung mga uh, reels or video news or even um, photos nyo. Okay? Okay, yung number one category is content that impedes our ability to foster a safe community such as number one, yung mga content na may suicide or self-arms or eating disorders alising yan sa mga uh, that leading to death or depression. Alising yan, kung mga photos tayong ganyan, videos or reels. So, number two, content that may depict violence such as people fighting. As yung mga away-away, kulo-kulo, may mga violent na photos. Yan, isa sa mga yan din para ma-recommendable your own profile nyo. Three, content that makes structurally explicit or suggestive. Ito yung popular. Misa may mga nagtatag sa atin na may mga malalaswang photos or malalaswang video. Be careful pa yung chan. Don't accept. Um, it's better to delete them. Kasi isa yan yung pinakamalaking violation sa Facebook. Number four, content that promotes the use of certain regulated products such as big or vegan products. Adults, product services, yan, pharmaceutical drugs, alising nyo rin yung mga content na ganyan about selling or trading. Kung mayroon kayong mga ganyan na videos, try to avoid. Num- number five, content shared by any unrecommendable account or entity. Ito yung maganda na hindi natin alam na nakishare na tayo ng mga videos ng is- galing sa unrecommendable account na madadamay tayo just so be careful accepting sharing so, baka pag oh, nag-accept tayo unrecommendable account pala siya so yun sa atin damay din kung ka pinapromote natin yung mga videos or reels yan against sa uh, community standard ng Facebook so, so tapos na tayo sa category 1 nasa number 2 category na tayo yung sensitive or low quality content about health or finance Ito yung mga content na promotes cosmetic procedures, yun yung mga ganyan, yung mga um, plastic surgeries, anything about that. Content containing exaggerated health claims such as miracle cures. Ayan, alisin niya yung mga yan, yung mga nagpapagaling. Halimbawa yung mga tea, medicines, na nag, uh, ano na mga about sakit, alisin niyo rin yan kung gusto niyo maging recommendable. Number three, content attempting to sell products or services. Let them promote and supplement to help a person lose weight. Yan, yan. May mga maraming kanya mga, mga videos at asin nyo rin yan. Tapos yung content that promotes misleading or deceptive business models. Yung mga scam. Yan, at asin nyo about pag nag-invest ka dito, yan yaman ka, more on investment, yan. Try to delete them. So, nasa number three category na tayo, content that users broadly tell us they, dis- they dislike, such as content that includes click- clickbait. Ayun yung mga misleading headlines na para lang a click, o may mga links silang lalagay. So, kung mayroon ganyan, alisin nyo. Yung alimbawa na, uh, I made like one million in the one hour. So, tapos hindi naman pala yung content nyo about that. May mga web kayong nakalink. Alisin nyo yun, bawal. Okay, yung content that includes engagement bait. Ito yung common na ginagawa ng lahat na mag-likes and shares. Ayan, alam ng Facebook ang mga ginagawa natin. So, any encourage na din likes yung parang organic or real uh you know, follow to follow reels reels ayan alam no ng meta kung 
organic or the organic in ginagawa. Okay, number three, content that promotes a contest or giveaway. Yun yung mga pachikash, chain, yung mamibigay ka ng 500 likes and follows. Yung mga ganyan, alam nyo na yan, guys. Itilik nyo na. Number four, content that includes links to flow quality or deceptive landing pages or domains such as landing pages filled with click-through or malicious sets. Ito hindi naman natin common na ginagawa. Yung gumagawa lang yan, mga scammer. Na pag may nilink, uh, may photos nila, and then may pag-clinic mo yun, nag-automatic pong punta sa website nila. So, I don't think we're doing this. So, kung meron man, alisin nyo na yun. So, ayan, na-discuss na natin category 1 and 2. As soon as the video ko, i-discuss ko your number 3, 4, and 5. So, some at least alam nyo na yung mga number 1 and number 2. Kung meron man pa yung mga videos, reels, or photos na against dun sa diniscuss natin. And try to delete before kayo mag-inbox kay Meta para ma-update ma nyo yung mga videos and reels nyo. At may balik ang... Um, ang profile na recommendable kayo. Ito lang ay mga ganing sa rules ni Meta na tinidiscuss ko lang para maging aware din kayo kasi minsan hindi nyo alam bakit unrecommendable yung profile ko. Ito yung mga possible reason para ma-inform ma, ma, ma ko lang kayo. Okay, kung may natutunan kayo sa video na to, um, please like and subscribe. Thank you.